Hello. I'm sure most of us have happy memories of visiting places in Scotland where there are so many beautiful places to visit. But where else in the UK would you want to visit once the lockdown restrictions are eased and you decide you want to change the scenery? Here's an example. One of the places I would like to travel back to is Devon and Cornwall, and in particular, Polperro. On the southeast coast of Cornwall, situated between Plymouth and St. Austell. As you can see from this picture, Polperro is a beautiful, charming, quaint fishing village. Easy to step back to in time because it's largely an unspoilt fishing village. You can almost imagine that it would have been a place for smugglers and haunts of pirates. At least that's how I imagine Paul Perro in days gone by when I used to visit on day trips from Plymouth, which was the family home of my youth. Paul Perro has beautiful cottages that cling to steep hillsides around a small harbor with spectacular views of land and sea, making it an artist's paradise. The painting you're seeing is by Tom Morton and shows the inner harbor of Paul Perro exactly as Tom Morton could see it from his own studio. This painting is hung above our family fireplace for the last 25 years. As you can see in this picture, there are no cars and no people. You see the beauty of an old fishing harbour in a narrow and deep valley. The buildings are higgledy-piggledy, and no two are the same. The small landing area for fish can be seen on the right-hand side of the harbour as we look at it. Hope for a different life after the pandemic lockdown restrictions are eased is what we're all hoping and praying for. Getting to know Jesus a little better as each day in Lent passes gives us a chance to hope and pray for better things to come for all people everywhere. Jesus offers us hope for a better world and he also offers us forgiveness of things wrong in our lives and a fresh start in life. Jesus also offers us unfailing love and he says to each of us for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him shall not perish but will have eternal life enjoy reflecting on this as you think about what places you might want to visit in the summer months god bless you and bye bye